In this video, I am going to show the basic setup and enabling of the department codes on a Toshiba eStudio 4505 AC and similar machines. The first step you will need to do is enter a department code if you have not already. To do this, you hit the counter button from the home screen, department management, the box next to password, Press the box for the keyboard, and unless you have changed it, the admin password is 1234567. And OK. Now, because we do not have anything stored yet, the only button available is Department Registration. I'm going to press that. You can select any of them. As you can see, you've got 125 um, multiplied by 8 tells you how many you have. Press number 1. Press the Entry button. First thing we want to do is put in a department name. I'm going to use test for this video. And then in the second box you put the code. And you can put any combination alphanumeric. I'm going to go with the basic 1, 2, 3, 4. Press OK and OK. Here you can actually set um, quotas. You can basically say um, this account can get 100 color copies and if you leave black off, unlimited black copies. Um, I'm going to not put anything in here. Press OK. And I'm going to close. Now that we have one registered, we can now go to um, Department Management. And we will hit Enable. And here's where we can get into all the fancy settings. The one I'm going to point out is the No Limit Black. Because I have a lot of customers that ask for that. By pressing that and enabling it, now anyone can walk up to the machine or print a black and white copy. If they want to do color, it will ask for the code. So I'm going to exit out of here. And we'll go into copy. You can see we're in black and white. Go to color. It asks for the code. Press the box. One, two, three, four and OK and OK and we're able to make full color copies one thing to keep in mind once you put the code in if you walk away depending how long the reset is set on your machine anyone can walk up and make copies on that code in order to stop it you can either hit this key button or the function clear button twice and as you see you go in full color and ask it again And this um, concludes this video.